بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم Brother and sister, respectable ulama, assalamu alaikum jami'a wa rahmatullah. Thank you for attending this evening Love Muhammad event. I hope you all enjoy tonight's program. We, we are all have something in common and that our respect and admiration of our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam this common emotion united every one of us against anyone, against anyone or anything that seek to divide us. They, un they unite us against those wanting to cause suffering, mayhem and weakness in our ummah. Our message tonight is very clear, we will not be divided. Thanks the organizer, which include Love Muhammad, Minhaj al-Qur'an and Ahlul Bayt Society, and of course our sponsor, which include the above organization, as well those you see in the screen behind me. We want to keep this day special, as we hear almost every day, so much negativity is spread, so much difficult news to listen to. It is now more important than ever that we have such event which focus on the amazing personality of the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam as an inspiration for us to do more to serve Almighty Allah. We feel Glasgow and as a whole Scotland is an example for, of how united Muslim and communities can be and it has been shown yet again in the past year by how active many people have many have been with their positive campaigns for peace and justice across the world. We, of course, can do more with your help. Tonight, later on, we will be asking each table to write some point that you want to see from Muslim organization, as well as point which to see in general as improvement. Because as Ahmad said, Yes, we are here to remember our, reflect on the life of a unique individual, but we are here to progress new ideas, new ways of working. One thing we have been working on recently is creating a Muslim Scholar Council. Many of the scholars in the room have signed up to this and we wait for others to do so. The council will act as a united educated voice for scholars of different sect and background. This will be a unique achievement as nothing of this exists in the Western world. So we have a year of lots of existing work to do. As person who have lived in Glasgow for many years, I have gladly seen an increase of collaboration amongst the Muslim communities here. Therefore, I urge everyone to maintain this invaluable relation amongst, a relationship amongst each other and try to increase this in the future. Let us set an example for our kids in which they can take in their future in order to them, in order for them to set a good example for young Muslim, for our community. Let us also show the whole world how we as a Muslim live in Scotland in harmony, feel free from all extremes, ideologies, and thought. Finally, last by no means the least, the least, let Allah and the holy teaching of the Quran and the beloved Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam be the center of our action and they that the very best and they they and by that the very best in us can be seen. We hope to see you in incoming gear taking part in an initiative and hope you all enjoy this evening. Thank you very much. Wassalamu alaikum. Mm -hmm.